Well guys, welcome back to me and Peace Show, Brilliant Stars video, and today guys, we're going to be looking at a Luxray deck. This deck plays three different Luxrays, and Luxray, you do not want to mess with. So, we got three different Luxrays, and all of which are pretty playable. We got the Luxray with Raid from Rebel Clash. When you evolve it from Luxio, you do 160 damage for one energy. We can actually put Luxio on top of the deck with a Ranguru. We can actually draw into it. So, if we draw into Luxio off the top of the deck at the beginning of our turn, we can put it onto our bench if our bench is not full. The problem is we can't evolve the Luxray Luxio on the same turn, but it's still really cool. It cheats an evolution. doesn't have makes us not have to worry about rare candy. Then we have the Luxray from Battle Styles with Scar Strikes. For two energy, it does 100 damage. If your opponent's active, already has damage on it, does 100 more damage. Pretty clean attack, nice chunk of damage. Good way to KO a V Pokemon, especially with quick shooting. And then we got the brand new Luxray from Brilliant Stars, which is the icing on top of the cake on this deck with the attack Energy Crush doing 50 damage for each energy attached to all of your opponent's Pokemon. And there are quite a lot of decks right now that can really walk into this attack, especially those Arceus V-Star decks that put energy in play for free which is really, really cool. And when you're attacking with all these different Luxrays, your opponent will probably put more energy in play. If you're not, if you just use this Luxray by itself, I think it's a little too inconvenient. But having the ability to play three different Luxrays is really cool. There's actually a fourth Luxray in the format. <laughs> The fourth Luxray is terrible. So yeah, before we get the video, of course, show to the sponsor, Card Cavern TCG. As always, guys, if you're ever looking for any PCGO pack codes, make sure you get your codes over at Card Cavern. Card Cavern sells codes online for the cheapest. So if you're looking to get any set codes like Brilliant Stars, Evolving Skies, or any other sets like Chilling Rain or Battle Styles or any other specific PDCGO code related item, get them all over at Card Cavern. If you get anything at Card Cavern at the checkout, use my discount code, code LDF for a 5% discount on your order. Help channel, help yourself out, and help out Card Cavern. So shutter Card Cavern, check them out, use code LDF. All right, so the Luxray deck, here we go. We got three different Luxrays in one deck. Again, I just said there is another Luxray. Let me pull it up. Yeah, we got the Fusion Strike Luxray. Two for 90, bro. Insane card, would recommend. Um, but yeah, no, the, these three Luxrays are actually pretty good. I mean, all of them are good attackers, and they all are good in different scenarios. Now, yeah, I'm playing the Italian Engine. Best way to play the deck, you get access to quick shooting, which really complements uh, Scar Strikes and Shady Dealings, helps you easily get rid of any Luxray. Cynthia's Ambition is a really cool supporter to play in this deck, too. Um, we got Speed Lightning, Choice Belt, decent. I mean, not really much to talk about, to be honest with you. It's just a straightforward deck. Um, the new Luxray is pretty cool. Again, Energy Crush is good if your opponent accelerates a lot of energy into play. Energy Crush... And, no pun intended, crush the opponent. If your opponent even puts 5 energy in play, that's 250 damage with a choice belt. That is 280, which can one-shot Arceus V-Star. So there's a lot of really cool things you can do with this deck. I really like this deck. And actually, after playing it in today's video, man, it was actually pretty sick. And I really enjoyed it. The three different Luxrays are really cool. I am playing Manaphy. I'm getting tired of being paired against Urshfu all the time. So I'm like, right, I'm putting Manaphy in the deck. And Jolteon, obviously. But mainly Urshfu, because Urshfu is more popular than Jolteon. Um, but yeah, that's the list. I think it's a lot of fun to play. This deck is really cool. Honestly, pretty strong as a stage two deck. You definitely don't want to mess with Luxray. Let's go try it out. All right, looks like we're going first. We'll take it and see what our opening hand is looking like here. Ooh, I all right. You know what? It ain't too bad. I do want to try to get a Shinx down or a a Sobble, but I'll take it. We can Guru the Luxio on top of the deck, and then hope we don't get Marnie, and I can draw into it so I can guarantee a Luxio. So I can go with the Luxray. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. We'll see what we're playing against. Um, again, just hoping for something here. I could... I mean, here we could Primate Wisdom into a Shinx. I'm hoping we don't Primate Wisdom into a Ball Searching card. Well, it wouldn't be bad if we do. I just don't want to. Yeah, we didn't get it. All right, whatever. Wisdom Luxio on top and hope for the best. Research Archer. Okay. Pass. And if we get Marnie, that would suck. But if not, we guarantee a Luxio. Then I can hit with a Marnie of my own. It looks like we're playing against a Water deck, which is perfect. Depends on what they're playing. And no Marnie. All right, cool. We're guaranteed to have Luxio. Okay, they're playing Inteleon VMAX with GMAX Spiral. Interesting. Okay. They're probably playing Max Bullets. They're probably going to need to at least put a uh, thing into play. Manaphy. Yeah, don't mind if I do. I would like to put Luxio on my bench. Yes, I would. That nah, was Marnie then. Can't really afford to research his hand away, so. Get him with a Marnie and hope for the best. Which, yeah, it's not bad. Speed energy is pretty clutch. It's not a bad hand, though, at all. We can go Shinx, Shinx, Attach. All right. I was kind of hoping we'd get a uh, Sobble there. We'll put Evil Wind Sense on top of the deck. Yeah, Marnied. Yeah, we got Drizzle. All right, rip. <laughs> Where's my Sobbles at? Okay, not great. I mean, I need a Sobble, but we'll see if Primate Wisdom keep helping me out here. Not, not great. Yeah, they're going to max Bullet. They can knock out... Shinx and Guru this turn, most likely, if they... Well, they need to find Frost Moth. 
and a switching card to go with it. They can't retreat it. Yeah, okay, I don't think they have it. That's good. I really need to get something going, though. This is a matchup, too, where full energy crush is going to be pretty good. Because, I mean, they're putting energy in play. It's all good. All right, Hydro Snipe. Okay, what do we draw? Other than the Evil Wind Sense. Why did I say that? Okay. I think we just primate wisdom. Another Shinx. I mean, I'll take it, but it's not no draw in our hand, which is the problem. Luxio could get knocked out. We're probably gonna have to use this Lux right next turn. I have choice belt. It's just a one shot. I need to save raid, but you know what? I'm gonna use this opportunity. Oh, we have two Sobbles. No wonder I can't find it. Uh, Manaphy's in the deck. That's good. I still have most of my supporters. I got six speed energy still in the deck. And here goes nothing. I'm going to grab Luxio with this. It is a little risky to do that, but this way I can protect one of the Shinxes. They could boss my Luxio. You know, that's why I'm kind of doing that. Now, I'm hoping my opponent plays into my Energy Crush, because currently we don't know what we're drawing. For all I know, I might not draw out of this. I'm hoping we can just knock him out the Energy Crush here. Okay, wow, they just did that. They just rare into an Italian. That is actually really bad. But they might be stuck with a two-card hand, though. They have a bucket. All right. If they put three energy in play, I can do 300 damage with energy crush, which does mean I can go choice belt for knockout. All right. So I got the knockout Luxray. Okay. Now I definitely can knock him out. I don't even need choice belt. They have a one card hand. What are they quick shooting? The Luxio? Okay. Thankfully, they can't knock me out. I have 90 HP. Thank you, Pokemon, for giving this thing 90 HP. Oh, my God. I'm actually surprised they went after it. I feel like they should have just killed a Shinx. That's fine. Okay. I didn't see the quick shooting coming, and I'm glad I went for the Aluxio, but they could have had a boss, right? That was kind of my thought process. But thankfully, they did just walk into an energy crush, so I can crush them with some energy. Unfortunately, we are still in top deck mode, but at least now I can go out in peace, knock out this Centelion. We get three prizes. We know we have two Sobbles prized. Boss, okay. Come on. Sobble number one, okay. And we get a quick ball. All right, that gets us Manaphy, which is actually really good right now. Now, hopefully, we don't get KO'd, but we probably will. We have 70 HP left. Well, actually, now we're dead. They just played a Nessa of all cards. We're dead. We're deader than dead. They can just go Nessa for the max spiral. But I could still win. All I have to do is just hit him with the Luxray, right? Just raid him. Fine. It sucks for me to be in top deck mode for so long, but... I mean, all we gotta do is take out two Intellions. We win the game. Then it shouldn't be too hard to do. All right, Mr. Luxray. As long as they're not using that Bench Snipe Inteleon, too. Yeah, they have to go with this Inteleon. Now, this does mean Energy Crush is weaker, but now I can go with the uh, Luxray that evolves from Luxio to knock them out. Which is good. We gotta be careful, though. I am gonna grab Manaphy here because they're probably gonna... Well, we know their hand is currently dead. We know they have an Inteleon, but still, I ain't taking that risk, bro. They got a prize and a top deck. So... This is not the play I really want to do, but I am going to give him Shinx because I don't want to give him Luxio unless I draw into a good card here. That would suck. Bruh. I was going to say, I didn't want to go Shinx because I don't want to give him the... Uh, I don't want to give my opponent the ability to just like body me here with the uh, thing, but I actually just drew that. Wow. I don't want to lose my Luxio because I need to evolve into the other Luxray, but I just drew the Speed Lightning. I honestly might just play... I can put it on the active. Oh, I just wanted the bench Luxio, right? Yeah, it's fine. Oh, rare candy. Okay, mountain, 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 mountain. Yeah, that's fine. We can play that. I got a Shinx. Cool. All right. Well, here we go. We got Drizzle for next turn. I could boss here. I could boss Frostmoth out. Well, here's the thing. If they knock me out... Right, I can still go Energy Crush Luxray with Rare Candy. So, I'm open to them just knocking me out. I'm not going to play the boss. I'm just going to hold the hand. I'm going to let them knock me out. So, I can either win the game with Luxray Fast Raid, or I can win with Energy Crush. They put three energy in play, plus I have Choice Belt. So, either way should work if all goes well. Because I am probably going to go with a Cynthia's Ambition. And with the Manaphy in play, they can't knock out Luxio or Shinx. So, they have to go after the active here. Pretty crazy game. Despite hitting for weakness, it kind of slowed down a little bit because we were bricking a little bit here, but it might might work out in the end. We'll see. 
it might still work out in the end. Interesting. Kind of, not. I wouldn't call it a close game, but, you know, it got a little hairy. They're just going to play Bucket. I mean, hey, if you want to walk into my thing, go ahead. They're probably going to do quick sh or double gunner, though, whatever it's called. Double gunner quick shooting to put some pressure on my little squad here. The active. Wait, what? Why do they have the active? Unless they're retreating into the other Inteleon. No, I don't know why they hit the active. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't hit the why they hit the active. Okay. So here we go. All we gotta do is just rip a Luxray. Okay. Uh just put the active. At this point, I think we just kinda have to. I need to play as many cards as I can. I kinda regret not playing boss. Maybe I should have, but at the same time, I mean it's like just knock me out. Alright, can I Ryan for a game? Do I have basic energy in there? I don't. You know what? I think we just research, right? Yeah, no research. We can draw more cards research than Cynthia. Just need a Luxray, and there we go. That is GG's. We drew into the Eva Wind Sense, which means we can grab the Luxray and win the game against my opponent's Italian deck. Kind of a close game. They actually put on quite a bit of pressure, and uh, we got him in the end, though, with a raid knockout. Boom, there we go. That's the dub. Could have been a close game. The mana fee was really crucial because it could have been pretty bad if they started taking out my Shinxes, but we will take the dub. We get to do a lot of damage. In fact, we got a daily challenge done. Yo, let's go. Daily chat 35 coins, bro. Don't mind if I do. I'll take it. Yes. We're going first. Coin flip glitch there, but we'll take it. And we get a pretty solid hand. What am I going to open up with, though? The question. So many options. We'll open up with Shinx. Because we could have a turn two Luxray, right? So I think we'll open up with Shinx. Yeah, we could be eyeing up turn two Luxray here. Now, I could even win sense for Luxio on top of the deck with Guru. Or I could save that. I think we'll do the Guru play, though. Because we're probably going to drizzle for a supporter. So I am going to go Guru for Luxio. All right. I think it's Rapid Strike Malamar. I mean, I guess we can probably beat it. It shouldn't be that bad of a matchup. Got another Sobble. Yeah, we can beat Malamar. It shouldn't be that bad. No, hopefully not. We probably need quick shooting, though. But we should be able to beat Malamar if all goes well. Wisdom that. Can you get another Shinx here or another Sobble? Research? Perfect. So I can drizzle for something. I don't really know what to drizzle for, to be honest. You're playing against Malamar. It is beatable. It's basically just we take the first prize, we win. Right? That's how it goes. Right. As a single prize deck. Now... We do need quick shooting, though, because Luxray, the, both of them, actually, none of our Luxrays are really that great in this matchup. We actually need quick shooting. I might drizzle for Rare Candy and Talion. I don't know. I'm tempted to. I kind of, we need quick shooting. That 20 damage is really important. I don't know. I might actually have to do that. Anyways, let's get Luxio in play here. I could, well, I guess I can Wisdom and Talion on top. That's probably just fine. Um, really don't know what to grab with this. I guess I'm good time with the mountain. To be honest, just get another Shinx into play. Wisdom that. And hopefully we get a good card off this primary wisdom. Quick ball. All right. Cool. No research. Can we get Rare Candy Luxray? We do. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Cool. So Rare Candy. This, the Electro Step Luxray might be better here. Because we want to save our heavy hitter Luxrays for later. So let's grab it. Cool. Grab that. Rare Candy into it. Now, the question of the day is, what am I going to go into? Guru? Probably right. Guru's the most tankiest Pokemon. So, I'm going to go into Guru here. Yeah. Knock out the active. And then go into Guru. I like it. I like it. I mean, they'll probably kill Guru. They need, what, four Rapid Strike cards? But it's the bulkiest Pokemon. I and mean, I don't really think I need Guru anymore anyways. Because at this point, we basically just set up the Luxrays and we're chilling. The only benefit of Guru is I can put a Luxio on top and then guarantee it. Because we know they don't play Marnie in their deck, but... I can always rod Guru back. The main thing is, as long as I get quick shooting down, we are chilling. We are going to need quick shooting here. Not only to kill the Malamar, but also because all the Luxrays just can't quite meet that mark without that extra damage push. Because the Energy Crush Luxray and Billion Stars is not going to be useful when they have one energy in play. We have to use Flash Impact, which means we need the quick shooting to help us get there. So, And Scar Strikes Luxray. Let's see how it goes. We can KO this Malamar... And as long as we get the first prize, we should always win the game, right? We get the first prize, we should always win technically if all goes according to plan. 
Might even do Cynthia here with Drizzle. We'll see, we'll see. Yeah, there's Malamar. They need another Inkay. They need to knock me out and get Inkay down. They have a four-card hand currently. And only one Sobble in play. I almost said one Shobble. One Sobble in play. So do they have the play here? They have a Rod. If they don't kill Monkey, we're chilling. Because we got the Balloon in our hand, too. They need to take out Monkey. Oh, they have a Karina. No, they had a Karina. All right. They still need Inkay off the Karina. They've already done Octillery. They need Inkay and three cards. So. They don't have the Inkay. Perfect. All right. Let's see. They probably have the Knockout. They had the Inkay too, but they had to put it back in the deck. So it looks like the other cards in my opponent's hand must have actually been pretty terrible then. That's what I like to see. It doesn't really matter what Luxray KO them with, I don't think. It's all relative. Go here. Go here. Go here. Do we get double or candy? Nice. We'll go Rare Candy and a Luxray. We'll save the Luxio, obviously, for the other Luxray. And then... Do this. Do this. Grab Cynthia's Ambition. Yeah, you might got Cynthia too, Malamar. So do I. Nice try there, bucko. And then I'm gonna level ball. I think I got a Luxio in the deck, right? Yeah, we're chilling. All right, cool. Get Luxio. We get, as long as I got an energy, right? And then we'll just Scar Strikes. Because we know they're not going to Marnie me, so I can just build my hand as big as I want. They make sure I keep constantly having energy in play. Basic energy, perfect. I was hoping to get that because we have Raihan. All right. I think we're winning. They can't take a prize this turn. We can do another Scar Strikes. I don't have a boss play just yet, though, unless I draw. I, unless I can draw into an uh, no, to a boss. But I can't boss. But what I can do is I can Electro Step, knock out the NK with Luxray if I want to do that play. If they don't play a Manaphy down. Okay, they got Cynthia too. We're both doing Cynthia. There's a Cynthia. We're living in Cynthia's world right now. It's Cynthia's world. We're all living in it. Whatever. However that quote goes. Another drizzle. Okay. So they have to get double NK here, which I imagine they will. Or they can get Manaphy. But they got to imagine I have a boss play, which I actually don't. But they probably think I have a boss. So they're probably going to go double NK. But I can knock out the NK there with the Luxray. Which is good. Because we also forces Remedy to move by knocking out NK also. So that's kind of decent. So work out in our favor but we're really well set up right now as long as i can just keep kind of flowing attackers we should be able to just win the game no problem could even probably build up this thing at some point to have access to waterfall they grab a boss and there's nothing they can bring in that can get stuck i guess i can boss the intellion but again i have raihan i'm actually gonna attach the intellion then so they boss knock it i can raihan so, yeah, that's what I'll do. I get the sentiment. Knocking out this Intellion is kind of rude. All right. They need to get double NK. If they don't get double NK, they're just like making so many misplays. No double NK. Sure. We'll take it. <laughs> Patch that there. We can try shenanigans on my Intellion. A little quick shooting the NK. And we can knock it out with Electro Step, which is pretty awesome. Knock that out. Boom. Cool. I have to switch. Okay, that's kind of dumb. Alright, we'll go into the Intellion. They can't knock it out anyways. Take our prize. We get another energy. Yeah, we know they're not playing Marnie. Uh, we can't be stopped. This is just great. <laughs> this cannot be stopped. This deck can just not be stopped. Alright, we're chilling, bro. We're chilling, dude. The Luxray power. I kind of want to have a board state where I have all three different Luxrays in play. Oh, uh, you know what? I might go for that. All right, we can do another Electro Step, though, which probably is probably just the play, right? Probably, probably. That's not even a word. I do want to try to get three Luxrays in play in this in this match. That'd be kind of cool. Just have, like, all three Luxrays down. That would be pretty baller. I might try to go for that. Yeah, my opponent... I, I don't know how they haven't done double Inke yet. It's like, you gotta always do double Inke. Because I ain't playing no V Pokemon. They're so far behind, too. Like, I don't even know if they can win. Even if, like, realistically, there's no window of opportunity for them to win, to be honest, at this point. Like, as long as our hand never gets disrupted, I, do, we, I don't think we can lose. So we'll see what happens. I guess Electro Step, but to be honest, there's nothing to go into. I don't know. If I go Electro Step, right, I do lose. I have to give up Intellion. I can't do that, obviously, so. They are trying to boss my Intellion and knock it out, though. I get the sentiment. What do we draw? Rod? That is actually fantastic. That works, too. I mean, I could just KO them with Energy Crush if I really wanted to. Or I could just go Flash Impact for the knockout and then save 
this guy for a rainy day, which... You know what? I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to use my other Lux right here. I'll knock him out Flash Impact. Yeah, I'll camel with Flash Impact. I'm cool with that. Then I can save this thing with Inteleon for later. Because here's the thing. They knock me out. I got Rod Evil Wind Sense. Inteleon comes right back into play. If they try to boss it there. I know they're holding on to a boss. I would have been better to Energy Crush. Because now they it's not as hard to kill Inteleon. They need, what, three cards in their hand? But, I mean, they're going to kill my Inteleon anyways. With that, yeah. No, there's no way Inteleon's ever living the turn anyways. But, you know. We'll see what they decide to do here. Again, yeah, Malamar. So, let's see if they knock out my active or if they go after the Inteleon. And I can do a board state where I just put three Luxrays in play, which I think would just look pretty cool. And I don't think it matters. They're going to boss. Is it going after Inteleon or Luxray? It is going after my other Luxray. Okay. Fine by me. As long as quick shooting survives, who cares? I feel like you always go after Inteleon there. Right. You always go after Inteleon there as the Malamar player. So, I, they shouldn't have went after my Luxray. Because, like, at this point, I don't care if Luxray gets knocked out. Because, like, we are... I mean, I guess it's my attacker, but, like, I'm also warming up for, like, a Waterfall knockout on, like, an Inca or Remorator or something. Or Drizzle or Sobble. Right, they KO me. That's fine. See you later, Luxray. Did that have a Luxio? No, it didn't. Okay, cool. Alright. I mean, this game's basically wrapped up. I don't think I really have to try too much at this point. <laughs> Just go Luxray. You know... Then we can... Do I have any Shinx left? I think I do. Yeah, I got a Shinx. We'll get another Shinx. Why not? Sure. When in doubt, Shinx it out. Do this. There's the other Luxray. Quick shooting that. I just like literally the game. I'm pretty sure they have no way to stop me. You know? Those flash impact for the knockout. Put 30 on the drizzle. That's like GG's. They, they, they can't stop me. <laughs> Luxray for the win. Beating Malamar. It always feels good to be Malamar. This deck is annoying to play against. Especially when you're playing... A three prize or two prize deck. Malamar is a nightmare to play against. But when you're playing, you know, triple Luxray, doesn't feel so bad. But yeah, that should be GG's. I did want to try to go for the triple Luxray board state. I guess I could still do that, but I'm, it's not worth it. Let's just carry on with what we're doing. It's like, there's nothing they can really do. The only way they can win is to Marnie me, but like, I'm pretty sure Marnie wouldn't even work either at this point. <laughs> and they don't even play Marnie. There is no... No Malamar player out there who would ever play a Marnie in their list. But yeah, that should be GG. It does feel good to be Malamar. Malamar, it's not as bad as like Mew or anything, but it's still like, you know, it can be annoying. So there's the Cynthia. They're going to go all in. They're going to go big. Go big or go home. And that'll be GG's. We can win with the Raid Luxray if we wanted to, which I'll probably just do. Use all three different Luxrays in one match. And there we go. That's game. Cool. Beating Malamar. Probably a favorite matchup as long as you... You know, don't draw like a potato. You know, it's pretty favored, as you guys saw. We were able to keep up and win the game. All right, we just go. Knock him out, raid. Raid Shadow Legends, boom. Take the dub. Nice, let's go. Triple Luxray. We Triple Luxray threat. We used all three Luxrays in this game. Feels pretty cool. All right. Going first is good. Especially if we can maybe get like a Primate Wisdom Luxio combo. No, not with this hand. This hand's not bad, though, I guess. Though Sobble isn't getting knocked out. But they are mulliganing all right now. This hand's a little bit better. I think it's a fire deck. Is it firebox? Victini VMAX. All right. It's beatable. It's beatable. Can't really one shot most of my stuff. They do play hammers, though, which is kind of a headache. All right. I press a Luxio. Helion's all in there. Guru. The Lux rays are all there, which is good. We have one rare candy prize. And we'll see energy. All right. And then we'll take it. Not too bad. All right. Do this. Nice. That's pretty good. Uh. Well, quick ball drizzle away. Ooh, that feels bad. But I am going to grab... Uh... I'm going to go Guru, to be honest. And then just put the Marnie on top of the deck. I have Rikini Luxray. That's what I'm thinking here. Just go Guru. Yeah, I'm going to go Guru. They're not came on my Sobble this turn, right? So I'm going to go Guru. And I'm going to put... I'll oh, put Drizzle on top of the deck, probably. It's more important. Nice. It's a good hand. If we don't get marnie here, we have the attack... With Luxray, assuming we don't get bodied. Okay, that's a little annoying. I was hoping they weren't playing any uh, Tool Jammer shenanigans. They're going to judge me. No, dude, what? No, that disrupts my Guru. Bro, what? 
That's a that's not cool. Yeah, not the worst judge ever. Got Marnie at least. Don't think we're gonna get there again, but we'll see. Would be nice to get there though if we can get there, which we do not get there. Maybe I can get there. I can see three cards here. Yeah, I didn't get there. Hmm. Probably should have went keep calling, to be honest. Put that on top. Ooh, nice. All right, that works out. All right, whatever, sure. I probably should have just played even one since for Luxio there, to be honest, but they could have boss knocked it out, so didn't really want to do that. I probably should have. There's Fan. Okay, that's fine. Actually, I don't care about that because we have energy anyways. Plus, we're playing Cynthia. Assuming you don't get judged again. That was very rude. Didn't see the coming. I didn't see that coming, bro. <laughs> Freaking judge. Okay, research. No Marnie, no boss. Nice. So Sobble will die, which does suck. Not a fan of losing Sobble, but it's better than nothing, I guess. I actually don't mind that fan, though, to be honest. Putting the energy back is pretty helpful. Did they whiff? They got another fan of waves. Okay. Thank you for giving me more speed energy out. That's always good. Do they have a knockout? They need... No, they whipped a knockout. Let's get it. Okay. Well, the way this is going, I don't think I'm going to kill them in return. So I'm just going to maybe use the opportunity to keep calling then. We'll put a card back in the deck we don't really need. Shuffle that back in. Another Cynthia. Well, then. All right, you know what? Screw it. Let's just use opportunity to get Luxio. Even if my opponent gets, you know, if they boss me here, whatever. We'll go Luxio. We'll keep calling and get Sobble down. Should have keep calling all along, but whatever. It is what it is. We'll keep calling, get that down, and we'll see what my opponent decides to do here. They can take out Sobble or they can take out Luxio. They take out Luxio, I got Cynthia, and then I can try to do two drizzles into a, into a Lux. Oh, boss, nice. The only problem is I need to not whip energy, but they did just fan a bunch of energy back. All right, let's see. They got the energy. Do they have the Victini VMAX? Their game plan might be to go Victini V, Victini VMAX. It looks like it is. All right. We can raid him here. Yeah, let's see what our top deck is. Evil Wind Sense is pretty fantastic, but I can't. I can get Luxio. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to play it. Grab Drizzle. Get the Drizzle down now. I need to get an energy here. I need to need to play my hand down for this energy. I need to not whiff energy here. This could be pretty bad if we do. Oh, I don't really want to Quick Ball boss away, but I might have to. I'm going to Quick Ball. All right, we'll get rid of boss. I could Wisdom boss on top of the deck. I need, I'm not... No, let's just do that. I'm not trying to lose my boss. Rare candy. All right, Cynthia it is. Got to lose Cynthia then. That's fine. We'll have to manage. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Well, Cynthia, we need to not with energy here. Thankfully, we got it. Okay. Got a pretty good hand too in the process. Uh, They're down two fan. I think we want to save the speed energy. So I'm just going to hold it. Is that it for my turn? Am I just going to attack? Do I want to do anything else? I could get a Luxray down. But I also could get Quick Shooting, which I kind of want to. kind of want Quick Shooting next turn. We could get Marnie, though. They can't knock me out, though. That's the thing. Okay, you know what? Let's just get a Luxray in play. Let's do it. Both are actually pretty good, especially this one can hit pretty hard. All right, we'll grab this Luxray then, sure. Because we can always Raihan to it. Here, we'll grab that guy, sure. Oh, Raid. Well, they might not even be playing Hammers. I'm surprised we haven't seen one yet. I mean, they're playing Gear, Fan, Catcher. We'll see. That's fine. I don't know. I The reason why I didn't want to get rid of Boss is we're probably going to need to use it at some point, right? I don't want to just lose my Boss. Like, I'd rather just keep the Boss. It's the only one in the deck. If I had another Boss... I would have been like, all right, Cynthia, you're gone. Losing both Cynthias could be a bit of an issue. As long as we just played really smart with the resources, we should be okay. This is why I didn't play the Speed Lightning, right? So I have more draw to work with. I don't know. Maybe we should have gotten Inteleon because I can go double quick shooting. There's a hammer. There's a Tails. Another hammer. Uh-oh. Nice. I'd like to see. They can grab VMAX here. They can evolve the active. I actually want them to evolve the active. So we can knock it out. Not this turn though, but we can still hit it. They're gonna boss. Oh no. No, not my drizzle, bro. How what do you ever do to you? Okay. 
And I'm glad I just got Luxray. I can't knock that out, though. No wasting energy in the discard, right? No, I do. So I could have Raihan. I can't remember if Raihan's in the deck or not. I can knock out the Luxray, though, if I go Raihan. Okay, we'll do it. I should have Raihan in the deck. Rod's a good top deck. Okay, Drizzle. We don't have it. We don't have it. We got it. All right, we're chilling. Yeah, I figured we had we had it. I was just making sure, though. You never know. Get the Drizzle and Subble back, because we're going to put that into play here. No Rai Honda Luxray. Grab a Sobble with that, sure. Speed Lightning. Nice. Research is nice. I can put that on top of the deck. We take a knockout. Like to see, baby. Let's go. Scar Strikes. Boom. That's a KO. All right. Let's see what our prizes are. Luxio's fantastic. Mountain's not bad either. My spells is also fantastic. All right, literally three good prizes. Now, we might see another Marnie or Judge. Can they knock me out? No, they can't. They're 30 damage short. So they can't knock my Luxray out here. I could actually try to preserve this for later, which is tempting. Yeah, there's the Judge. That's fine. Again, disrupting my Guru is a little annoying, but not in the end of the world, as long as we don't draw poorly, which we shouldn't. We're chilling. Yeah, I'm tempted to preserve my Luxray here for later. But I actually am going to do, right? Because it's kind of the... It can do the most amount of damage. I kind of like that. We'll just attack with this Headbolt Luxray. And then, yeah, we'll do this. I don't think they play any more than two fans. So I'm gonna, we'll put the energy in the discard. And then, what else am I going to do? I don't really want to do Shady Dealings. I could go quick shooting here. Do I have any V1 Senses left? I don't know if I do. I guess I get Luxio. Okay, well, let's just do Drizzle anyways. Should probably still do it anyways, just to get the double Shady Dealings. Okay, I do have the option. So I can go quick shooting here. Try to get as much damage on them as we can. Yeah, let's do it. Sure. We'll go quick shooting. Just try to, you know, set up this thing to die. And if my opponent tries to boss drizzle and I can't use Inteleon, who cares? Because it ain't gonna matter. Alright, I'm gonna hold the balloon in case they trap something. Like Guru try to buy a turn. And I'll just primarily list them Inteleon on top of the deck. And hit him for 120 damage. Okay. We're trucking along. Hopefully, they don't knock out my Luxray. They are down one boss so far. No, they're down two boss, right? Yeah, they're down two boss. Okay, nice. That's only four cards, though. That's really good. It's actually good they're building on multiple Victinis, because now my other Luxray can do 150, which is 170 with the quick shooting. Okay, that's good. So I even have the other Luxray, which can come in and clap this Victini. They can't evolve either, because if they evolve, they get knocked out, and I win the game. They do play three fan. What? They're playing three Fana Waves? Okay, wow. I was not expecting that. I have never seen a three fan deck in my life, but there you go. The first for everything, I guess. Okay, that's fine. It's kind of crazy, though. Now, I could go Electro Step here into Guru. But they could Jammer and Trap me. I don't like that. I think we just let our Luxray get knocked out. I'm fine with that. We'll still put that on. And then... So oh, many options. Hit that. And then I'm gonna... Any options? I can get Luxio. We can try to use Raid again. It's pretty good stuff. Okay, cool. And once again, I will Primate Wisdom and the Intellion on top of the deck. And then... Toy Spell's pretty good. Alright, we'll take it. I'll just knock him out with Headbolt. Alright, cool. We just gotta take out one more Victini. My opponent needs to take another knockout. And we get a Marnie. More draws good. And we get... what's? We'll take the bottom card. Boss. Not bad. Actually, I don't think we need Boss anymore, though, to be honest. All right. So we just got to take out one Victini VMAX to win the game. Not too bad, right? Not too bad. Okay. All right. They had a Kabu. They could hammer me here. Which is a little intimidating. I'm not going to lie. They could hammer me. Nope. They're catching me. They do get Tails, which is good. What were they going to bring in, though, if they got Heads? They, probably the other Luxray, right? Because it hits the hardest. Oh, they didn't get energy off that. Okay. Oh, now our other Luxray can hit for 200. It's not enough, though, but it is a good chunk of damage. I mean, this is a pretty good turn to just kind of... 
do this wisdom that on top of the deck and then just like they could marnie me but we had it but i put Italian on top of the deck they judge me whatever i guess if they judge me i guess i don't want to draw that so we'll just we'll just burn that because i don't want to get judged into it and then we'll just head bolt actually we can get rid of boss too i don't think we need the other boss right well not really now oh but now we're not drawing Inteleon. okay never mind i messed that up oops now we're not drawing Inteleon. i don't think it really matters though but i did just mess that up i am not drawing Inteleon anymore misplay on my end i didn't want i didn't need the boss though because they're out of victini so i don't need boss but i shouldn't have primate wisdom first because if they judge me i just don't want to draw the boss or the mountain but they are going to boss me here Whatever they bring in, it doesn't really matter. They go after my Luxray, but that's fine. I still have game with my Luxray, right? Well, not yet. 150. Oh, no, I do have game. I have game with this Luxray. Yeah, we can win with Head Bolt. We go Choice Belt, Quick Shooting, and that is game. I wanted to use the other... I wanted to use the other Luxray there with the four energy that in play, but I'll take what I can get. We'll take that knockout and take the dub against Victini with our Luxray deck. Once again, putting in work, Luxray is awesome. And we've used all three Luxrays in this video and to good use, which I really, really like. All right, that'll be it for the video, guys, on the Luxray deck with those matches. We got some pretty good matches in today's video showing off all three different Luxrays, which I'm grateful and glad we were able to pull off different Luxray combos in this video. Now, this deck was actually pretty good. It impressed me. I'm not going to lie. The three different Luxrays all have their own different things going on, but it really forces plays out of your opponent that are really cool, especially you go raid and then your opponent puts more energy in play. You kind of, they walk into the energy crush. It's really cool. I actually really enjoyed this deck quite a bit. I don't know what I would change about the list after playing it. Honestly, a second Raihan is like the only thing I would maybe consider playing mainly for the scar strikes luxray um but other than that deck was a lot of fun to play definitely give it a try and uh yeah let me know what you thought of the video guys if you guys enjoyed today's pcgo video leave a like in the video if you're new to the channel subscribe down below help me on the road to reaching 27 or 26 000 subs by the time this is uploaded i don't know where i'll be at right now i am pre-recording videos in advance i am going on vacation when you're watching this i am going to be on a vacation so yeah thanks for watching guys check out car coming down below use code ldf to get any code check out my twitch my twitter and my discord server and i'll see you guys later Bye bye